Biome erected the Tower of Insolence in his defiant pursuit of immortality. But Biome's arrogance incited the wrath of the gods and brought annihilation to his empire. El Muradin was shattered and Aiden was thrown into a chaotic age of war. In the absence of Bayum, usurpers arose, forming loose alliances and waging war against one another in a mindless pursuit of power. The strongest and fiercest of these factions belong to the followers of Baelith, the Dark Lord. They believed that they could dominate Aiden through chaos and fear. They sought to establish a new empire in Baelith's name. They sowed havoc across the land, inciting conflict amongst their enemies. This lasted until the emergence of Hardin, a wizard whose power was second only to Baelith. Hardin formed the Silverlight mercenaries to stand against the armies of Baelith and changed the tide of war. Victory and peace were all but assured, but Hardin was betrayed by his two closest advisors who had been seduced by the dark magic of Baelith. Once more, Aiden fell into darkness. All would have been lost if it wasn't for Valdir, a Silverlight mercenary who resisted the armies of Baelith. By uniting the armies of the various kingdoms of Aiden, Valdir commanded an army the size of which had never been seen before. Every soldier in its ranks was ready to lay down their life to finally end this dark age. This is the last stand against the darkness. Heroes will rise. The revolution has begun. under control here. Let us hurry. Any later an elfin will be stranded. I'll lead the way. Follow. Use the direction pad to move. Come on! This way! Tap this button. <sighs> we made it! Now to deal with the next problem. The soldiers can't breach the castle gates until some- I'll deal with the wyvern. Stand clear! We've defeated the wyvern! Everyone, on to the castle! to defeat the enemy. Soldiers, come in when I signal! We've surrounded them! Cut them down to the last man! <laughs> I've been waiting for you, Valdir. This will be your final resting place. Come. Okay. 
Kingpin! The age of oppression is at its end. Along with your vile clan! <laughs> How amusing. Many fools have stood where you stand now and spoken those same words. They all ended up on their knees, begging for their lives. You'll do the same! Wrong! It's your turn to kneel! Everyone, attack! Aldir seized Aiden Castle and that tumultuous age came to a close. Huh. We've reached Talking Island! <laughs> they say the key members of the Silverlight Mercenaries are all from Talking Island. Well, let's get going. Let's set off to find our own clan. One that will become legendary across Aiden. A creation of Gran Kine. Humans have well balanced stats and adapt. <laughs> 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 dark elves specialize in dark magic. They used to worship the goddess Shilin until their race's downfall led them to deny their faith. Creation of Gran Kine. Humans have well balanced stats and adapt quickly to any class. Humans worship Ein Hassad, the goddess of light. <laughs> Ein Hassad formed the elves from water, making them agile and light on their feet. They are protected by the goddess of water, a Ein Hassad created the dwarves from the land, and they are handy and physically powerful. They worship Mothar, the goddess of land. We will overcome this hardship. Welcome. Is this your first time on Talking Island? Well then, 